Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Behind the Boards. I'm Jenna Reynolds alongside veteran goalie Justin Robbins on the men's ice hockey team. Ladies and gentlemen, the Pioneers have entered the most pivotal time of the season where the outcome of a single game and the points that come with it can alter the entirety of the AHA conference standings. The Pioneers have nine Atlantic hockey games left, eight of which are against teams that currently stand in the top five spots. At this time, with such a compressed pro style schedule, you guys have your eighth game in a 15 day span on Saturday. What have practices been looking like and prep in between games? It's definitely been, um, been different. Uh, we're used to practicing much more, so um, they've done a good job of kind of ma managing managing our workloads and for me it's just been fun um, getting back into games and you know for the players and the guys in the room even when uh, when it becomes a grind it's much more fun just playing a lot of games and you're able to just get into the flow of things especially for me coming off injury for a while so that's awesome and Sacred Heart currently stands first with 34 total points a lot on the line mental toughness how important is that to you as a player, but more specifically as a goalie? Uh, I think it's huge. So um, I think uh, when you get to this level, the game becomes much more mental. Everyone's physically capable. Um, so it's just about being consistent, doing, uh, doing what you got to do to be ready every night and just know that uh, you're going to do your job for your team and be consistent uh, even when the schedule uh, gets crazy and there's a lot of games. So um, been a, as a team, just trying to find ways to collectively uh, be on top of it, even when we're when we're tired, and just stay on each other and hold each other accountable. So. And you mentioned ways as a team. Are there any personal traditions or team traditions that you guys have to ease those game nerves? I mean, I'm very uh, I'm very specific on uh, on game days. Um, I just, you know, I go through my routine, uh, kind of personal thing. Like uh, when I get to the rink, uh, I'll go do my own stretch, just kind of. Relax, get my mind right. Nothing too crazy. Um, I love just playing sewer with the with the guys. Like that soccer game to warm ups, just keeps us loose. Just have fun. Just a little uh, little compete game against the boys, and it's always uh, it's always fun to win that one before the game. You're always feeling good. Get the win and then the win on the ice. Yeah, that's the plan. <laughs> And lastly, Robbins returns on the ice this season. After bouncing back from an ankle injury, he got last October's game versus Holy Cross. Now up next this weekend, you guys are versing Holy Cross for the first time this season. How great does it feel to be back between the pipes? Uh, it feels great, yeah. So um, it's been uh, it's like a long, probably 15 months between, uh, between games for me. So, um, you know, like playing them, I guess, is... Uh, it's cool just to be back um, in, against the same team I was hurt against, but at the end of the day, we need, uh, we need all these games and all these points at this time of year, so I'm not really thinking too much about whether it's Holy Cross or anyone else in our league. Um, just go compete, do my best, and give us a chance to win. So. That's awesome. Good luck to you this weekend and the rest of the season. Thank you so much for watching Behind the Boards. I'm Jenna Reynolds, and be sure to join us in the beautiful Martiri Family Arena. Friday night, Holy Cross versus Sacred Heart, two game weekend series.